Man, what's going on? What's going on? I'm really trying not to do videos in the damn car, but man, I'm too busy with these damn projects. But whatever. But anyway, so you know, we all know in a couple of weeks um, we're supposed to see um, Roley take on Javante Tank Davis um, in a in a nice little fight that they're about to have. Um, it's not necessarily the fight that I wanted to see, but just it'll be a good fight. Um, so, but not as, um, stories coming out, um, I guess when it comes to women making allegations against Roley about, I guess, certain things that he supposedly, you know, allegedly had done or whatever, um, doing dates and things of that nature. Um, and, the um, main question people are asking is that, is this going to be a problem when it pertains to this fight? Is it going to cause an issue or keep this fight, let's say, from not happening? Um, I think people just need to understand that this is not the NBA. Some people are talking about oh, how certain things happen, like let's say in the NFL, you know, with uh, Houston's quarterback and how, you know, he's been on the sidelines because of the allegations that were made against him. But this is not the NFL. This is not the NFL. This is not the NBA. This is not the, it's not, you know, Major League Baseball, you know, anything of that nature. It's not. So, when it comes to boxing, or whatever, it's different. It's completely different. And if certain quote sponsors jump off, other sponsors will jump right on. They don't give a flying f. You know, they don't care. They're gonna still, there's gonna still be a part of that event. Um, you look at Mike Tyson. Wow, what he went to jail for? The man comes out, and what happens when he comes out? You know, what happens when he comes out? He still fights. There's still a a uh, substantial amount of people involved uh, A substantial amount of sponsors still involved Didn't matter From fight after fight after fight after fight uh, Floyd Mayweather He got into a little scuffle with his, you know, the mother of his child He got found guilty And he was going to jail Everybody knew that he was going to be locked up Yet even though he was going to be locked up What happened? You know what I'm saying? He still fought Miguel Cotto Everybody still stayed on board And it was still a big fight It still happened you know, so when it comes to when it comes to boxing, it's like, you know, people don't really care like that. You know, we saw what's his name? Uh, uh, I don't remember the guy's name. Um, he, he fought Anthony Joshua for, for Anthony Joshua's last, last um, IBF mandatory. Um, There's they'll sign the top rank and do the top rank card. He grabs his girl and, and you, know, you know, unwantingly, you know, kisses her, even though she didn't want that from him. And it was a big, you know, kind of thing for a little bit. But no one cared. He said when they fought Anthony Joshua. It's like, yeah, whatever. But boxing is just it's weird. But boxing is different, you know. Um, I would say even the UFC is different. You know, in the UFC they have, when it, MMA has the highest, more domestic violence cases than any other sport. By a long shot. Yet these guys will still be fighting <laughs> on the UFC. Still be fighting at pay-per-view events and other platforms it's not a big thing for whatever reason when it comes to the fighting sports it's not as big they allow a lot of crazy stuff to go on without i guess you could say you technically being punished for it whatever and regardless at the end of the day they're still gonna i mean unless you know showtime was like oh we're not gonna do this or we're not gonna be a part of this which is that's not gonna happen especially in this situation where you know, it's two, what, five weeks away before this particular fight, you know, for, for what has been put out there, it's not going to stop this fight from happening. You know, it doesn't matter if 30 people come out. It won't matter. It will just, it will just, you know, bring you just more attention to the bout. That's the way they'll see it. They'll see it as if, hey, it's just bringing more attention to the bout. That's number one. And that if these people supposedly, you know, if they... Um, if they, you know, believe that, you know, something was, you know, was unlawfully that was done, then they need to go ahead and follow with the police and, and let that whole process take, you know, place, which isn't going to take place in five weeks or whatever the amount of weeks that's left, you know, so that fight's going to happen. Um, anybody thinking that it's not going to happen or it might be stopped or, you know, Tank might have to find a replacement fighter, anything like that, it's not going to happen. This is boxing. Boxing is a crazy place. Boxing is a crazy sport. 
you know it's just it's different it's completely different just like kind of like when it comes to the basketball or football you start you start fights you know on 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 the field of play it's a it's a big thing it's like whoa it's like a huge thing and you know it's disrespectful and you're gonna get suspended you know 20 games 30 games five games three games depending on how crazy or bad it is you can get all kinds of trouble but in hockey you can bang out all day the first is sit back there let you fight when you're done they'll pull you off they'll put you to the box for a little bit then you come right back in it's just a different it's a different arena it's a different space so when it comes to boxing it's the same type of thing you know so i expect this box to still go on um tank is looking in incredible shape Tank has been really focused and has really been on point about being in shape, man. Training and being in shape and not blowing up. Um, he's, 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 I don't know what's happened, but he's really been on point when it comes to that. And he's going to, I believe he's going to beat the brakes off this kid. You know, I, I believe this kid's going to come in there. He's going to probably come in the best shape he's ever been in. He's going to try. Um, he has some power behind him. If he happens to catch Tank, even if this is a thing, Tank has, you know, has a chin. I've seen we've seen Tank get caught clean and just eat it like it's nothing. He's on a different level. So even if he was caught, I don't think it would even matter. You know, I think he would walk through it and handle his business. You know, so but you know, we'll see what happens um in a couple of weeks. But like I said, I said it before, I say it again. As far as this bot being off, nah. And as far as the allegations that have been made against him, at the end of the day. That's what the court of law is for. You can't just go by what people say. If you believe that something was done, that that you know that you were harmed in any kind of way, then you need to go. It can't be always. It can't be a oh they have a fight going on and he's making bread right now. So now and they a skit some of them literally literally said that oh you know we're not gonna let him just live his life and and become a superstar and all this other stuff when we know what has been done to us. No, if you believe something was done to you, then you should want you know to go to the proper authorities and file the proper reports and, and 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 do what's necessary to keep this guy off the street or to put that thing out there so people that reputation on him you know what i mean regardless if he's a superstar or not put that reputation of people other people when they get with him they understand that hey you got to be careful when you're with that guy it can't it shouldn't be hey hold up you're a star now you're in a big pay-per-view now oh hell no oh hell no you're not gonna shine. I'm not gonna let you shine like that. You, it can't be that. You know, it can't be that. If something was so wrong happened to you, you should have said something before. You know, he's been fighting on like Showtime. You know, he's been fighting on PVC events. People are talking about him. You know, but where now he's getting the biggest bag he's gonna ever get. Now, now you want to say something. Now you want to stop that. Nah, you should have wanted to stop this guy for whatever he did. If he did anything. You know, regardless to begin with, just just for you, you know, just for you and then for the welfare of other people so he can be in the system when he can be monitored. If he, quote, did something that he shouldn't have done, Th you know, that's what you're supposed to do. Not, oh, man, now he's getting this big bag now. Oh, hell no. We got to stop him from getting this. He's about to get the bag. And we thought he was just doing these little fights. But now nah, nah, he's doing this big fight. Oh, hell no. The bag shouldn't matter. It shouldn't even be in the equation. You know, it shouldn't be an equation at all, you know, because when you, especially when you say something like that, then it puts into question what you're even, you know, but, you know, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens with the whole situation and we'll see if it goes forward in any way. I'll uh, see if any other people come out or if anything is filed, you know, where then the proper steps can go on to find out, you know, what happened and if he did anything wrong, but that to the side as far as the fight's concerned it's gonna happen like scrap share i'm out